Verbal in Paradise. Due to an update yesterday, the PSN website for Dragon Ball Sparking Zero showed that local multiplayer was a thing, differently from the Steam page and even the game page. That led many to believe that it was confirmed. I remain skeptical, however, to that information since it wouldn't be the first time something like that changed. And lo and behold, today they removed the two-player option from the PSN page. Does that mean local multiplayer, a feature that exists since time immemorial in every Dragon Ball game, will not exist? Frankly, in my opinion, I believe it will have local multiplayer, however, it won't come in the base game, only with a patch. I say that because of the amount of bugs we keep seeing in these trailer slash gameplays. Since they are working on a fairly new engine in Unreal 5, it is proving to be troublesome to add multiplayer without frame rate loss. Either that, or they are building up to a big reveal of said feature. That is a lot of copium, I might add, but it's part of the job. Or so one would hope. With that said, it wouldn't make a difference to me if it does have local multiplayer or not, because I wouldn't have anyone to play with. What I would hope, however, is a photo mode and training mode, so that I can make the reference videos with extra effort when the time comes. But for now, we'll keep waiting to see what Summer Game Fest will bring in the coming days. This has been iKevinX and subscribe so that I can continue to making these updates as if I were a big shot narrator. Thank you for watching.